I had the great pleasure of attending Canoe Copia back in March up in Madison, Wisconsin. This show is the largest paddle sports convention in the world, and it occurs around the second weekend in March every year. With all the manufacturers, adventure outfitters, destination locations, and 50 plus presentations of our beloved paddle sports, you'll need at least two days to see it all. I'm releasing a myriad of short videos of me interviewing some of the most interesting manufacturers that I think you'll like too. Here's what's next. Okay, we're into the show here, and I must say I feel like a kid in a candy store. Hey, I'm at Level 6. Uh, they make uh, foul weather gear and dry suits, and got Alex Lohman here. I'm going to put a mic on him, and he's going to kind of show you some awesome products they have for uh, the recreational kayaker to extend your paddling season. Don't put the kayak away in October. Go all winter on a nice day, because every once in a while you get a nice day. Sweet. All right. Uh, we're going to start with our brand new Gulf boot. Uh, this is a super fun product. I'm a big fan. It's a neoprene boot with vulcanized rubber, which is a multi-heat stage glue, making it completely waterproof right to the top. The real nice selling point of this is that if you take it off in your boat, you don't want to wear it. It rolls up super small, very packable, um, but also completely waterproof and very comfortable for a long day. It's also really warm. So if it's cooler out, it keeps your feet nice and warm inside whatever you have on. If we migrate over this way, we've got products like our Nahani jacket here, which is a really nice multi-use product. It's a rain jacket built specifically for kayaking and canoeing. So it's got these vent holes. So if there's inclement weather, you have it zipped right up, breathe through it. It's got a hood that you can remove in here that comes all the way out. The big selling feature for me is it also has these gusseted wrists. So when you're kayaking, you can cinch that around your wrist and you don't have water dripping down. If you're lifting things above your head, water's not coming down. And it turns out that's really nice in your day to day as well. When you're walking around, it's a rainy day, you lift up, water comes down your arm. Super nice feature. I'm a big fan. Um, and we can also move over here with a more, much more technical piece. Um, not everyone will need this, but this is our new Loki dry suit made for recreational canoeing and kayaking. The main difference, if you're familiar with dry suits, is that it has an adjustable gasket. So you don't constantly have to have a tight gasket gripping your wrist and your neck. When weather is nice, maybe it's cold out, the water's cold, you want that thermal protection, you can leave it loose. But if inclement weather comes in or you're in a situation where you're nervous, you can tighten the gasket up and be 100% secure that if you fall out, you are safe in the water. Um, it is a three-ply breathable nylon, so it is a breathable suit. It is a fully recycled nylon as well, and it is also PFAS and Teflon free. It's the first suit of its kind that is completely Teflon free. We're very proud of that fact. It's something we work very hard on. All of our drawer eyewear, in fact, is 100% recycled. So that's awesome. something that we awesome. view very highly. Want to move over to the knee? Just yeah. The feet. Yeah, let's go. Let's go on over. Let's do this. Something else we have is we have lots of neoprene accessories. This is our limestone based non petroleum neoprene. The nice thing about it is that while it is more environmentally friendly, it is incredibly comfortable. Um, the fabric is silky smooth, it's very nice on your skin. We have everything from skin tight insulation to a more loose fitting hoodie which is very very nice to like wear i in fact wear it around the office even so it's really nice to wear on a day-to-day -day, but it also has that insulation factor that you want when you're on the water in cold weather 